Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between shaping and planing. Machining is basically one material removal process where excess material is shared off by the mutual interaction between workpiece and cutting tool. Both shaping and planing are conventional machining operations that follow subtractive manufacturing approach, both utilizes general purpose machine tools and single point cutting tool. Quick return mechanism is employed in both them machine tools, however, their point of application are different. So, let's look into the basic differences between shaping and planing in a tabular form. Difference number 1, shaping is one machining operation where workpiece is held stationary while cutting tool, on the ram, is reciprocated across the work, whereas, Planing is similar machining operation but here the cutting tool remains stationary while workpiece, on the work table, is reciprocated under the cutter. Number 2, in shaping operation, workpiece, on the bed, imparts feed motion, while cutting tool gives cutting motion, whereas, workpiece, on the table, imparts cutting motion, while cutting tool gives feed motion. Number 3, shaping operation is performed in a machine tool called shaper also called shaping machine, whereas, planing operation is performed in a machine tool called planer, also called planing machine. Number 4, in shaping operation, quick return mechanism is integrated with the ram that holds the cutter. So shaping machine uses quick return mechanism for tool movement, whereas, in planing operation, quick return mechanism is integrated with the work table that holds the workpiece. So planing machine uses quick return mechanism for work table movement. Number 5, shape hair is traditionally a small machine and preferred for smaller jobs, whereas, planer is larger machine and can accommodate heavier and larger jobs. Number 6, shaping operation provides low material removal rate, thus shaping is less productive, whereas, planer has longer stroke length and can take heavy cuts. So material removal rate is high and the operation is productive. And, difference number 7, only one cutting tool can be used at a time in shaping operation, whereas, facility to accommodate multiple tools and simultaneously using all of them is also available in some planing machines.